Aaron, the Red Sox got on the board there in that first inning, but you guys answered with five runs there in the top of the second. Just how much did the tenor change when Aaron Judge hits that grand slam? Yeah, it was huge. You know, we I don't think we had hit a ball out of the ballpark uh, in this series to that point. Um, so to set the table there, you know, good matchup really made Bernardino throw a ton of pitches there and, and nowhere to go with, with Aaron there. And he's got a pitch to him, and, and Aaron with the big swing there and uh, get, gives us a nice cushion. Uh, you know, obviously they battled back to tie the score, but um, obviously that was, a, that was a big inning for especially after really struggling to break through, obviously, in that first game. We'd asked you a little bit about Aaron Judge offensively over the last couple weeks here, and we all know Aaron Judge is going to hit, but just for him to be able to come through in that spot in a big way, what do you think it meant to him? Oh, I, I mean, I'm sure, sure it felt good, but, I mean, he's, you know, he's all about winning at the end of the day, and he knows, <coughs> excuse, me, excuse me, as long as he can go out there, he's, you know, he's going to eventually get his, you know, when you got a pitch to him, he's going to take care of business. Solid night from DJ as well. Some major contributions offensively, just what seemed like it was clicking for him. Yeah, it was big. Um, obviously, he gets the infield hit um, that sets up the home run. Um, great job by <clears throat> Cabrera running through the bag there to kind of take away that potential force out that I think they kind of hesitated a little bit there, which probably allowed DJ to beat it out that set up the home run. Um, and then obviously the big, the, the difference making blow, a uh, nice shot off the left field wall. So, um, good to see him go out there and, you know, do what he does at the top of the order, getting on base and, and, and the big, big blow late. Did you like the emotion from Peraza, some tack on runs there? I did. I did. So it was good to see him really get into a ball. You know, he, he, uh, <coughs> he had a double earlier, which that was nice to see, you know, he's kind of been. You know, his, his hits kind of been just those balls in the five six hole. You know, hasn't been driving a lot of balls today. He drove a double and obviously the big homer. What's been making him <laughs> click lately? <clears throat> the well, I think today he clicked. I, I think he's I think he's been getting some results lately. Um, but today tonight was was a lot better. You know, he's capable of that. He's capable of driving the ball, hitting the ball with authority on a line. He's strong. He's got bad speed. Um, you know, working through things just mechanically to get in, in better striking position. Um, but I thought he had some good ones today, tonight. He booted a ball at third earlier today and was able to play good defense the rest of the way. What does that say about him to have that kind of day after it started? Yeah, he's, I mean, he's really good in the field and, and I think really, really comfortable in the field, even over at third where he doesn't have a ton of experience. It's kind of one of those tough where you're playing in, you're playing in even with the bag respect and the bunt and it's kind of that in between, you know, third base is, it's a tough one when you got to play in sometimes. You're at the mercy of the hop a little bit. So tough play, but answered back. The double play ball was huge for us. You know, tonight Clark had a lot of traffic out there, but I think he got three double play balls, which were huge. Um, and, and, and Oswald right in the middle of it over there at third. Any concern with Florial? It seemed like that, that ball got him pretty good off the knee. Yeah, we'll see. Um, he seemed to shake it off all right, though. You mentioned the double play balls for Clark, but just overall some trouble with the defense behind him. But but what did you think of Clark? Yeah, I thought Clark was good. You know, you know, stayed away from big trouble, and you know was helped by the ground ball in some double play situations. So that kind of salvaged his night a little bit. We didn't play the cleanest behind him, um, and but but I thought he was good. Um, uh, they put a lot of guys out. It's a tough left-handed lineup, you know, to go up against them. And, you know, there are a lot of base runners out there tonight against them. But, uh, you know, he got, he got a lot of ground balls when he needed them.